Here's today's In Touch Reflection on Forgiveness Without Limits. This month's reflection is based on verses 9 through 13 of Romans chapter 12. Love must be free of hypocrisy. Detest what is evil. Cling to what is good. Be devoted to one another in brotherly love. Give preference to one another in honor, not lagging behind in diligence. Fervent in spirit, serving the Lord, rejoicing in hope, persevering in tribulation, devoted to prayer, contributing to the needs of the saints, practicing hospitality. No one likes to be at odds with a friend or loved one, but thankfully, the gift of forgiveness is always available to us, and it's one that those of us who are believers must learn to both give and receive repeatedly on the long road of sanctification. In Matthew 18, verses 21 and 22, Peter asks Jesus how many times he must forgive a brother's failings, and the disciples' estimate of seven times falls dramatically short. Jesus' answer is shocking in its extravagance. He tells Peter that he must forgive up to seventy times seven. What the Lord means is that forgiveness has no limits. In the Christian life, our goal is to become like Christ in every way, and our attitude toward releasing others from their wrongs is no exception. Jesus said the greatest commandment is to love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind but we're also called to love our neighbors as ourselves. Forgiveness is one of the most powerful ways we demonstrate that love. Think about it. Is it easy for you to forgive others, or is it a challenge? Do you struggle to ask for forgiveness 